What's up, Greg? So I was sitting here and I was thinking about the time where Ethan on the Ace 3 Ace 3 podcast was making fun of Prince EA because Prince EA had this video talking about social media. It was kind of like a, a poetry type deal. And at one point he talks about how social media has shortened our attention spans. Now, while there isn't much scientific evidence behind this, I've seen personal evidence about this when I have fellow Greggs commenting on a Danny Gonzalez video I made a long time ago, and that's why I'm introducing to you the Danny Gonzalez Challenge. What is up everybody? This is Chris from The Rewired Soul where we talk about the problem but focus on the solution. And if you're new to my channel, sometimes what I like to do is pull different topics from the YouTube community and try to see what we can learn from them. So if you're into that stuff, make sure you subscribe and ring that notification bell because I make a ton of videos. So before I jump into the Danny Gonzalez challenge and what that is, I need to give you I need to give you a little bit of a backstory, all right? So on October 24th of 2018, I made a a joke video. Well, it starts out as a joke and then I get into the actual topic, okay? It's a 14 minute video. So in that video, I was clearly joking. Well, what I thought was clearly joking. I had terrible acting like this. Danny Gonzalez, AKA Young Faced. More like, I'm a silly liar face, am I right? And even worse acting like this. If you pay attention, he always says, don't look that up. Don't look that up, don't look that up. Don't look that up, but it's true. Why do you think that is? Why do you think Danny Gonzalez is telling you not to look that up? Is it because Greg is not the fastest growing army on the internet? I think so. And basically what I was doing was <laughs> exposing Danny Gonzalez for being a liar that Greg is the fastest growing army on the internet, all right? Now, I didn't wanna make this joke go too long, so at about three minutes and 10 seconds, again, of a 14 minute video, I explain that this whole intro to that video was a joke, all right? Now, this video has over 13,000 views now. And basically, every time Danny Gonzalez uploads a new video, the Greg Army comes at my throat and they send comments like this. I mean, yeah, he lied, but as far as I know, it's a joke. No need to put stock in those jokes. You're Craig. By the way, Greg is a joke. He's just having fun and it's not official or anything. It's a simple tagline for him. Oh my God, it's a joke. You're hella dumb because we know he's a joking YouTuber. So shut up. Honey, learn some facts. One, humor. Two, he's joking. Three, he great. Four, every single YouTuber jokes pike that. Honey, go back to kindergarten. Do you get that he's joking about being the fastest growing channel on YouTube? That's why he says don't look that up, hair flip. So yeah, <laughs> I still get these comments. And now you're asking, what is the Danny Gonzalez challenge? Well, here's what it is. As, as humans, we are very emotional creatures, okay? We, we react rather than respond. We do things on impulse. We have short attention spans because of our emotional reactions. So what happens is, is this is something that I struggle with as well. So I'm doing the Danny Gonzalez challenge too. I, I have a tendency to where I'm watching a video, I wanna comment before it's even over, right? Or if I see a comment that's very long, I can have the habit of skimming, right? And then I wanna reply before I even read the entire thing. You know what I mean? So what this challenge is, what I want for all of us is when we're watching YouTube videos or in the comment section of another person's YouTube video or even on social media or we're getting text messages or whatever it is, let's read the entire thing or watch the entire thing. Let's take it all in and let's pause before we react, all right? Let's, let's respond rather than react. I always thought that this would be great for YouTube, right? I know everybody has like, suggestions for YouTube and how it works and everything, but I thought this would be great. I thought it would be awesome if YouTube had a setting, maybe on the creator side, if they wanted to, where you could not comment on a video until it was watched 90% of the way through, 
all right? Like, they had to watch it before the comment section unlocks for them to say something. Because this is something that I see constantly. And, and yeah, like, this is just a larger issue as a whole. Like, one of the reasons I believe this is, in just my opinion, is that we are in a very fast-paced society, right? Like, you got Twitter, you got Instagram, you got Facebook, you got YouTube, everything. Like, we're just inundated with information constantly, constantly, constantly. And I feel that a lot of us, like, we're trying to keep up with that. So we're like, oh, I don't have time to watch this whole thing. I don't have time to read this whole thing. And sometimes it's even on a subconscious level, like, we don't even recognize that we're not taking the time to completely consume something, all right? So I want all of us to just slow down just a little bit and, and see how that changes things. Like something that I've been working on personally is just realizing how often I don't need to respond, right? Like I, I watch a lot of YouTube, obviously I'm a YouTube creator. I, I, I'm a fan of channels like Danny Gonzalez and many, many others. And yeah, sometimes like, I just don't even leave a comment. Like, I don't don't leave a comment if it's, you know, something that, uh, you know, I, I didn't like. Um, mainly when I leave a comment, it's something that I do like, and I give congratulations to that YouTuber, or I say, hey, this was a very great topic that you brought up, I appreciate this, and da-da-da-da-da. So that's something that I'm personally working on, as well as reading my own comment section. Um, I've, I've minimized the amount of comments that I reply to. I used to be all up in my comments. Now I kind of, you know, um, take more breaks and just kind of check them every now and then, reply to a few of them and all that kind of stuff. And that's something that I'm working on as well. So let me know down in the comments if you know that you have a tendency to do this, where you comment on videos. Like, are you one of those people who likes to put first? I'll, I'll give you that pass. If you want to be first on comment sections, go for it, right? But are you somebody who watches YouTube videos and before it even gets to three minutes into the video or before the video is even over, you're leaving comments on that video? Or are you somebody who's replying to comments without reading them all the way through, all right? So do me a favor, join me in the Danny Gonzalez challenge, all right? But anyways, that's all I got for this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new, make sure you subscribe and ring that notification bell because I make a ton of videos. And a huge, huge thank you to everybody supporting the channel over on Patreon. You are all amazing. And don't forget the April Q&A for patrons is up. So go over to the Patreon website or app or whatever it is and ask your questions for April, all right? Thanks again so, so much for watching. I'll see you next time.